Damn! He went. Missing kid, huh? Well, you came to the right man, not the right place. I've had enough of this, Piper. From now on, consider you and that little sister of yours on notice. He's a Sith! He'll kill us all! Battle-tested beast productions. My name is Ibaka. Uh, yeah, when last we played, we took back the castle, but Preston is stuck in a glitch that transfers him over there. So, fuck him. Let's uh, do something else. Um, what do I want to do here? No, let's. Uh, maybe we can get back to the main quest. Location of the Mystic Caravan. Where is? Go to Diamond City. Why not? Me and Cosworth will go to Diamond City. No, no. Take the Miniman off the... Take him off. I'm good. Preston can't figure it out, so I am leaving. And I will see him maybe in a few months. Never really know with that guy. Relay towers. Relay tower. The hell is that? Oh god, okay. <laughs> the hell is wrong with you? Come out of that hole. Yeah. Whoa. Die. Die painfully. You think I won't hit you because you're a mother? Huh? I could be a mother. You never know. What you got? That's enhanced. Oh goody, something to sell. I don't use all the specialized weapons. They're not all awesome. In fact, some of them suck balls. Calm down, Kazi. Okay, we're going to go ahead and go to Diamond City, do a little bit of the main story. Took back the castle, but that doesn't matter because Preston is in a glitch, like I said. So let us continue on. I'm not one to really talk politics. <laughs> Maybe ever, man, but that damn that damn presidential debate. I'm I'm sorry. That that shit was funny. Um nothing against the people involved. I just think that the candidates candidates are all so very old. It is exciting, Kazi. Uh yeah. Trump, Biden, they might both need to sit the hell down somewhere. <laughs> They're so old. <laughs> uh is this a trap? Hmm. I think this is a trap that somebody set for me. When I let the dog out, they're gonna attack me. Nice. Okay. Oh, see, there they are. Oh, the dog is on my side, awesome. Yes. His name is Teddy. I have a new pup. Where are you going, Teddy? Huh, there he goes. You're welcome. <laughs> I'm taking your food, Teddy. What is this, brown and meat? Hell yeah. Anyway, that's about all I can say about <laughs> the presidential debate. Uh, <laughs> I have no interest whatsoever, but Trump and Biden are just so, so hard to watch, but so damn comical. Okay, Diamond City is this way. I don't think we're too far away. Hmm. Any big plans for the fourth, Codsworth? No, me neither. If anybody has big plans for the 4th of July, please let me know. Uh, it's not that I don't celebrate it. I'm just a grown man now, and I don't like watching my money literally go up in smoke also jason pierre paul he blew his hand off that is another reason <laughs> why i don't play with fireworks anymore i actually have well i almost called him a buddy he's not a buddy i know somebody personally who blew their hand off playing with fireworks and because of that i don't play with them anymore like ever for any reason liquor bottle sure 
Always take the aluminum. Okay, that's enough. I feel like there's raiders around here that attack normally. What that is? Run that. Run them mintats. Mintats are drugs. Let me see. I think they're drugs. They're not just mints. They're not regular mints. I know in this junkyard there are some wild dogs. What's happening? Let's get it. Come on, come on. Whooping your monkey ass. Damn, y'all nasty. I'm going to kill you and then eat you. Ah! Damn it, Kazi. Run all that. Run y'all meats. All them delicious meats. Run it. Hmm. Let's see. I wonder if there. I don't remember if there's anything in here useful or not. I'm gonna have to scavenge. As you can see, this is just a regular junkyard, right behind Diamond City, where my son Steven should be located. Another bottle. Is there any more food? Hmm. I don't think I would ever actually eat a dog. Even if we're the end, man, I don't know. I actually really like dogs. Puppies are the best. Not so much cats. Are you a cat or a dog person? Hello there. Cats or dogs? Hey. Looking for Diamond City? Just follow what the, the hell? Signs. Did you just take drugs in front of me? And you did it again. That is not healthy. What is that, Jet? You need help, man. Damn. That's three doses. What the hell wrong with you, bro? All right. Let's get in Diamond City. Okay. What do you mean you can't open the gate? Stop playing around, Danny. I'm standing out in the open here for crying out loud. I got orders not to let you in, Miss Piper. Sorry, I'm just doing my job. Ooh, just doing your job. Protecting Diamond City means keeping me out, is that it? Hey, Piper. Oh, look, it's the scary reporter. <clears throat> I'm sorry, but Mayor McDonough's really steamed, Piper. Saying that article you wrote was all lies. The whole city's in a tizzy. <sighs> you open this gate right now, Danny Sullivan. I live here. You can't just lock me out. Godsworth. Open up. How you doing? What is this? What's happening? You. You want into Diamond City, right? Sure. Uh, what? Who are you? Shh. Lay along. What? What's that? You said you're a trader up from Quincy. You have enough supplies to keep the general store stocked for a whole month? That's not true. <laughs> You hear that, Danny? You gonna open the gate and let us in, or are you gonna be the one talking to crazy Myrna about losing out on all the supply? Jeez, all right. I need to make it personal, Piper. Give me a minute. She lied to you, Danny. Better head inside quick before old Danny catches on to the bluff. She's a liar. I, I had nothing to do with this. place, Diamond City. What is it? Oh, the Green Jewel? She's a sight. Everyone who's anyone in the Commonwealth is from here, settled here, <laughs> got kicked out of here. A big wall, some power, working plumbing, schools, and some security goons are what make Diamond City the big monster it is. <laughs> oh, love it or hate it. You'll see for yourself soon enough. Yo. Let's go. I didn't know you were going to talk that much when I answered that question. Piper, who let you back inside? What up, bro? told Sullivan to keep that gate shut. You devious, rabble-rousing slanderer. The <laughs> rabble level of dishonesty in that paper of yours. I'll have that printer scrapped for parts. Ooh, that a statement, Mr. McDonough? Tyrant mayor shuts down the press. Why don't we ask the newcomer? You support the news? No. Because the mayor's threatened to throw free speech in the dumpster. I don't know what the hell this is. Uh. Always believed in freedom of the press. Rightly so. A true medium for the people. Oh, I, 
Didn't mean to bring you into this argument, good sir. No, no, no. You look like Diamond City material. Do I? Welcome to the great green jewel of the Commonwealth. Safe, happy, a fine place to come. Spend your money, settle down. Don't let this muckraker here tell you otherwise, all right? I'm sure your city's a great place. <laughs> yeah, greatest house of cards in the Commonwealth. Until the wind blows. <laughs> now, <laughs> was there anything <laughs> particular you came to our city for? Oh yeah, my kid. I'm trying to find someone. Trying to find someone? Who? My son, Sean. He's less than a year old. Wait, your son's missing? Oh, you hear that, McDonough? What's Diamond City Security doing to help this man, huh? This isn't the first missing persons report to come through here, and now we have an infant who's been taken? No, don't listen to her. Well, I'm afraid that our security team can't follow every case that comes through. I'm confident that you can find help here. Diamond City has every conceivable service known to man. One of our great citizens can surely find the time to help you. Well, sure. And a mayor of a great city must know everyone. Who can help me? Well, uh, there's uh, one private citizen, Nick Valentine, a detective of sorts who specializes in tracking people down, usually for debts or whatnot. No, I have to get going. Of course you do. I'm sorry, Diamond City Security doesn't have time to help, but I'm sure Mr. Valentine charges a reasonable fee. This is ridiculous. Diamond City Security can't spare one officer to help. I want the truth, McDonough. What's the real reason security never investigates any cases? I've had enough of this, Piper. From now on, consider you and that little sister of yours on notice. Yeah, keep talking, McDonough. That's all you're good for. <laughs> Impressed. <laughs> Not everyone can claw information out of McDonough's tight-fisted hands. Hmm. Why don't you stop by my office after you see Valentine? Oh. I think I just found my next story. Is that an invitation for a, a private meeting, Piper? Yeah, me and Piper. I'm not married anymore in this game. We 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 gonna get something going with Piper. I'm looking kind of thick in them uh dirty rags you wearing. Anyway, what up, bro? I'm inside. Thanks, man. Where the homie that was back here? So, you're that traitor Piper was talking about. Something tells me she's pulled the wool over my eyes again. Am I right? I wasn't lying. I got a whole supply train coming in tomorrow. Is that right? <laughs> no bull? Well, if that's the case, let me put a down payment on some parts for the gate. Here you go. Anyway, Holy shit. welcome to Diamond City and all that. I gotta get back to work. I love lying to Danny. You're Sullivan, right? So, you're that traitor Piper was talking about. We just had this dialogue. Something tells me she's pulled the wool over my eyes again. What just happened? All right. I didn't mean to lie, officer. It all just happened so fast. Uh, oh, look at that. The first guy Piper pulled into a heap of trouble he wasn't ready for. Thanks for being honest. If it were up to me, we would have just let the both of you. But the mayor's calling the shots, and... Well, you saw how mad he is. Dude, I just want to trade. Anyway, welcome to Diamond City and all that. I gotta get back to work. Do you have things to trade? Danny. You gotta keep watch on the gate. My guess is no. Goodbye, Danny. The hell was that? Question? No, it's shut up. <laughs> okay, there is a lot so to do here. I suppose I hope to find more of a gem than a dusty home base. Civilization in the rough. Yeah, there's a lot to do here, and I'm not gonna do it all in one day, of course, but for now I'll just talk to Piper and her kid sister, who may be the spawn of Satan. Quick save for no reason. How are the paper sales? Well, the presses are getting overloaded. That motor is going to go soon if you don't replace it. Uh, you've been saying that for weeks and the old girl still hmm. keeps cranking. Stop worrying so much. I gotta head into the office. You start whistling if you see any angry politicians coming our way. Why? Is something wrong? Piper? Well, kid. Free paper to newcomers. If the Institute grabs you in the night, at least we warned you. A free paper? Sounds like quality. I'm serious. The Institute takes people. 
You should read up if you're sticking around. The Institute? You ain't heard of the Institute, mister? They snatch people up in the night and no one hears from them again. Oh. It's all in the paper. Better read up before they grab you, too. Uh, sure, kid. Sure. I believe you. Thanks. You are a real lost lamb in the wolf's den, mister. You know, I could kill you, uh, Nat, but I won't, because you're a child. I'm in City Market. Is there a place to, like, sleep, bro? Anyone is one of those things. It's the secretary hmm. of his firm and perfect hair. Mm -hmm. It says something about Nick Valentine. I kind of want to find that guy. I've got to remember where his office was, though. I believe this is a uh, Fenway Park, by the way. I hate baseball, but pretty sure this is Fenway. I just find baseball and soccer so boring. No, no disrespect, no disrespect at all. I, I, just not for me. I'm sure football isn't for everyone too. What the hell? Nah, I'm looking to talk to Nick Valentine. Yes. Yes, you do. Cosworth is awesome. You do want this butler, but you can't have him. He's with me, bro. Let's see, schoolhouse, no. Detective, here we go. Is this it? No. I said greenhouse. What? You mean the railroad? Let me see. Valentine Detective Agency. Told you your luck wouldn't last forever. His ties. Oh Nick. Uh madam. Hello. Something wrong? The bills. Huh. Get the bills. Another stray coming in from the rain. Rage you're too late. Office is closed. I know you must be busy, but I won't take much of your time, miss. It's important. You're right. I'm sorry. <laughs> I didn't mean to be rude, but it's just the detective. He's gone missing. Oh, damn. Do you have any idea how I could find him? He disappeared working a case. The Skinny Malone's gang had kidnapped a young woman, and he tracked them down to their hideout in Park Street Station. There's an old vault down there they use as a base. I told Nick he was walking into a trap, but he just smiled and walked out the door like he always does. Uh, quick save for no reason. Hey, I'd love to help, but there's a small matter of expenses. Money, huh? I do have 125 caps in the old rainy day fund. <laughs> That'll work. I'll find him. You have my word. Thank you. Nick should be easy to spot. He's always wearing that old hat and trench coat get up. Please hurry. Cosworth, you better quit acting like a little bitch. All right. We got to make money out here. It's the wasteland out this bitch. You know what I'm saying? Okay, we're going to go get Nick Valentine. I think he's pretty awesome. And he's not far. And I got time. Can I sleep here? No? Alright. Don't move, Sid. Oh, shit. What have you done with the real Riley? Where's my brother? I swear, I'm not a simp. Don't oh, shoot. Shit. For God's sakes, we're family. Put the gun down now. He's a simp. He'll kill us all. Damn! Kyle, no! Kyle, no! Okay, show's over. There are no sins in Diamond City. Hear me? You sure? Just you folks in your damn paranoia. Damn! Hey. He pulled the gun on me. My own brother. Hey, who hasn't engaged in a little friendly attempted fratricide in their life? I'm I'm not a synth. <laughs> I told him. I, I kept telling him. Why didn't he listen to me? I, uh... I need a minute. I'm tempted to kill him and find out for myself. Yeah. You know what, bro? I'm sorry about this, but... I need to know. <laughs> I need to know if this is a synth or not. Oh! <laughs> 
All right, Riley, you son of a bitch. You had some backup, so I'll let you live. What your brother got? Run all that. Y'all don't mind if I steal this stuff, right? I need you to step away. <laughs> okay, first things first, we should probably run home and get some supplies and re-up my power armor before we go and save Nick. But in, in previous playthroughs, I helped the Diamond, Diamond City security uh, kill super mutants. And I think I missed that. I literally went through the back <laughs> and came here. So I don't know if that's still an option to help them with the super mutants. Uh, they may have already killed them. I, I don't know. Damn right. Okay, never mind. I hear the guns. The super mutants are still attacking. Let's go. Let's go. Let me see. I'm gonna try to help Diamond City security here. All right, I'm here. Everyone down. Damn dog. <laughs> I need the upgrades, bro. It's nothing personal. Super mutants, baby hawks. I got you on the backup. I got you. Die, you green bastard. Die. Damn, it's dark out here. Piss our bitch like people with this tire iron. What's happening, bro? Where you at? Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. Why? Oh, now you want. Now Preston just made it back. Okay, wonderful. What's this? Run it. Run it all. Okay, that's better. Super Mutants like to keep bloody body bags <laughs> around with body parts and bottle caps in them. All right, bro, who up here, man? Y'all making all the noise in the world. It's nighttime. People trying to sleep. What's that? Run it. Let me see. I think that's all of them. You're all safe now. Oh, whoops. You good, bro? Damn. Not afraid of mutants, huh? No, You're not at all. That's right. I came for the mutant hound meat, that's all. Hi. Plenty of shops inside the city if you need to trade. <laughs> Excuse me. Oh, Lord. Why would they put mines in here? Don't you dare. They're really easy to disarm, though. Aluminum, yep. Always get the aluminum. And watch out for mines, apparently. Let's see now. All right, Kazi, like I said, ooh, look at that. Gonna go home, re-up, and then we're gonna save Nick Valentine. You, you got that, Kazi? Sir, a, a moment, perhaps? Codsworth, what do you want? Sure, what's on your mind? Oh, just a little something I'd like to get off the old proverbial chest. I, I just want to say what an honor it is for me to accompany you. No idea the horror these past two centuries have wrought. The initial destruction. Not knowing if you and your family were all right. Aww. Uh, it was a relief just to find the entrance intact. I'm sorry, Godsworth. It was so sudden. Not, not even time for goodbyes. Not a single worry, sir, as I shared your priorities completely. Family safety first. Above all else. And yes, while it was hard at first, I was able to eventually move on. <laughs> at first, it was the work, busying myself day and night, and believe me, there was plenty of it. But eventually, the work became light chores. What truly saved me was my memories, sir. Memories of you and the missus, young Sean, of your love and kindness. Aww. I soldiered on, fueled by hope. One day, if not you and the wife, that Sean, or perhaps Sean's children, would one day emerge. I'm glad you stuck around. Oh, sir, you don't know how good it is to hear you say that. I just wanted you to know how much I consider you family. I may be a mere robot to some, but I, I do hope you've come to see me as... Is that a question? You're family. You're my I butler. I consider you to be family too, 
Wadsworth. My Alfred. We're in this world for the long haul. Together. Mr. Jones, you don't know how wonderful it is for me to hear that. I feel completely recharged. Hilarious. Well, enough blither blather from me. Let's get back to it, shall we? Uh, yeah. Hello. Who are you? Hey. Yeah? So what's your story? Looking to trade? Rob me? Or just ask directions to Diamond City? Uh... Just looking for love, sweetheart. <laughs> Boy, have you come to the wrong place. <laughs> My loving days have long since passed. Really? But I'll tell you what, wise ass. You made an old girl smile, and that ain't easy. You want to do some trading? I'll give you a discount. Let's see what you have. Here's what I got. Trash can Carla. Did did you pick that name? Get lost. Uh okay. Oh damn it. Cosworth. Now I gotta kill all these people. <laughs> you started this. Just remember that. Oh damn it. I don't mean to do that. Uh Who the hell said that? What is this? Please, you gotta help me. This guy's a sin. He's gonna kill me and replace me and my family. Oh God! You can't. Don't you dare break him. He's the sin, and he wants to replace me. I don't know what's happening here. You gotta believe me. Oh God! Let that thing do this. There's a firefight just over that wall. Uh. Also, you are a sin. You're not the one that's gonna die here. Oh, thank God. Damn it, I'll kill you both. Oh no. Ah. ah. I meant to kill the synth, damn it. Oh. Die, synth. <laughs> I don't understand what synths are yet. Damn it, synth. Okay, alright. Damn it, the real art just died. I don't know what just happened. I'm sorry. I fast traveled here into a mess. Oh, wow. <laughs> Gotta love the wasteland, man. Uh, what else I got? Give me that gourd, grilled rat. Oh, hell yeah. What you got? Synth component. Yep. I should have saved the real person. Oh man, I'm sorry. Look how many shotgun shells I got. What the hell is that? Where's my robot, you sons of bitches? Jackasses, all of you. Don't move. Don't do anything stupid. Okay, I got one of them to comply, but not the other one. Where's Cosworth? Oh, you bastards kill Cosworth. This is not what's supposed to be happening right now. I'm trying to save Nick Valentine. <laughs> Who else is shooting? You suck. Don't you use that stim pack. Run it. Okay, Codson. Oh my gosh. Why? Who? Who and what? Ah, oh, no. No more. I'm out. Saving Nick Valentine is the objective. I'm about to mess up my damn power armor. Uh, let me see. Let's go back to this. Just keep running, Kazi. I'm, I'm not fighting everybody. Oh, gosh. I threw a mine back there. I did not mean to do that. No super mutants. No. I mean, not super mutants. What are they called? Ghouls. Damn it. Leave the Kazi alone. We all good? Why are you in a graveyard? 
There's some kind of joke to be made about ghouls in the graveyard, but I won't. Nick Valentine. Okay, I think we're in an old vault. Yeah, we're here. Look at this place. I still say Malone's weak. Caught that detective snooping around, and what does he do? Locks him up. He ain't got the balls to just kill him. But don't let his feet go. She'll start swinging that bad person. Damn it. That, that was supposed to be way cooler. Um, go get him, Kazu. Let me see what they got in here. Actually, we're in close quarters. I'll use the uh, tire iron. Come here. <laughs> hmm. Kitchen scale. No, I can come back and clear this place out later. Just look for ammo and traps. And drugs. Hmm. Okay, nothing else. I don't know what a garter is, but I'm confident men don't use them, sir. Or, you know what, that's not fair. Men might use garters. If you use a garter, <laughs> please leave that in the comments down below and tell me what it, what it is. Okay, then. What else you got? Run it. What's that? Can I get back there? Hmm, no. Awesome. Nope, this way. Nope, uh, this way. Nope, back this way. There we go. Gotta find that sweet spot. Money, food, run it off. Mm, is that glue? Give me the glue. Damn it. All right, here we go. No way I could pick this. Damn it, Franklin. It's so easy to get low on health in this game, bro, and not even pay attention to it. Even when you're in power armor. There we go. Let me see. More money. Cigarettes to sell. Don't smoke cigarettes, kids. Or, no, no kids. Don't smoke cigarettes, anyone. It's, it's terrible for you. I hear. Hmm. All right, bro. We're looking for the detective, Nick Valentine. He is pretty cool. However, I will not romance him because science. In fact, I won't be romancing any of the men, so. <laughs> no need to ask me why that is. I just find women far more attractive, says Franklin Jones. Okay. These dudes are like everywhere. I wish my sniper rifle was a little stronger. Shot a guy in the head, did nothing to him. Damn it, Trigger Man. Die. No, don't pacify. Kill. There you go. There's so many of y'all for no reason. Damn it. Oh, no, I got him. Stop shooting me, you bastards. We can solve this easily with no violence. Uh, never mind. <laughs> yeah, this is what I'm doing now. There you go. Hmm. Who hell yeah, run that. I don't like using the submachine guns in this game. They're actually really weak. <laughs> Y'all all pay for your crimes. You stole a detective. I'm here to gather his goods. What up, bro? Are you bald like me? Sorry about that. Bald guys really should stick together, but you know. You playing for the other squad, you know what I'm saying. I need to get my lock picking up. Oh damn it. Yes. Anything in here? Hmm. I wish Codsworth could use a gun. Damn it. Don't think I can pick this. Of course I can. Hmm, no, I'm good. I'm done shooting. You all have weak guns. I'm going to run up on you and slice, slice you up. <laughs> Damn it. My power armor, you sick fuck. Come, come here. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> it's 
sorry about that, bro. Okay, who else? You. You'll die. Damn it. Hold still. There you go. Got your shoulder. Give me that neck. I shot you in the throat. There you go. I think that's everybody on this wing. We'll find out soon enough. I can't stand the damn terminals. I don't like getting on the computers, bro. I'm not going to do that a lot. Oh, Nikki. Mr. Nick Valentine. Franklin Jones here. Hmm. Skinny Malone's gang is going to pay for what they did to Nick. <laughs> Whoever he is. Not going to lie, don't really remember Skinny. But I'm going to find him and neuter him. Let me see. Uh, I want to shoot somebody in the head. Damn you all! Gotcha. Now suffer, all of you. What you got, bro? Run your pockets. Run it. Right in the ass. <laughs> you heard, Kazi. Ooh, a power recoil. I'll take that. Hey, bro. Bitch slap. <laughs> there you go. Okay. Let us move on, Kazi. Into the vault. It'll be like a nice homecoming for Franklin Jones. Open up. 114. Let us continue on. When they open the door. Why is that thing so loud? Hello? That you, Skinny? Nope. Armor? No Skinny here. Not Martha either. Turned out the lights. <laughs> that was me. I turned out the lights. Uh, that's great. Ow. <laughs> Dickless. Ran up on me and smacked me with a baseball bat. What the hell wrong with you? Now I gotta eat some more food. Let me see. Ooh, I'm like, hell yeah. Uh, I need to cook some of this food. Squirrel bitch, hell yeah. A lot of these guys have fedoras. It's reminiscent of the uh, gangs in the 50s from Greece. Was that the 50s or the 70s? I, 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 <laughs> I'm getting the years mixed up, I think, but yes. Vault Tech Lab Code, hell yeah. Yeah, that's one of my doctors. But yeah, Skinny Malone's gang is from the 50s or 60s or something like that. Let me see. I'm not going to do an impression, even though I want to. You'll never take me alive, Kappa. <laughs> was that was that good? No? I don't know. It's been a while. I've been very busy, Cosworth. Very busy. Vault Tech Terminal. Why not? Let's see what's going on in this vault. It's always something horrible going on in the vault. Can we want some preliminary construction? We are pleased. Yes, you are. Um, however, because of this, we will be seeing a lot of civilian traffic until, okay. Private science, uh, uh, enough of that. All right, what's this? Non-potable water access? Potable? Do they mean portable? Is that a typo? Doesn't matter, I'm leaving. I gotta find the homie Nick Valentine. No way to pick this. Hmm. Vault tech, vault tech. Vault Tech is evil, by the way. Just want that to be out there. They're not the good guys. Only I and Codsworth are the good guys. And Nick. Try to do some stealth gameplay here. Stealth gameplay. So I got a question. Why the hell would anyone build a vault out of a subway station? This place is like the opposite of airtight. Because they weren't planning to use it, you moron. We used to pull this kind of con all the time, man. Get a bunch of union boys to work some construction job. <laughs> That's great. Man, I wish you could shoot people in the dick. You can't, though. Damn it, Cosworth, move! You know what? You deal with it. That's your fault. I, I didn't. 
I didn't mean to shoot him. <laughs> okay, I'll run that, run that. I might have, ooh, drugs. Run that. I sell those. I sell all of those. Virtually. Hmm. All right, what y'all got? Run y'all's ducats. Run all that. A napkin? What the hell am I going to do with a napkin? In the wasteland. Toy truck. What the toy truck got? Steel and screw? Sure. Nah, we good. Hmm. Okay. Uh, hold on. More stealth. Oh, my sniper. <laughs> oh, that's great. Can I shoot the spotlight out? I don't know if I can or not. Did they notice I just shot that guy's head off? I guess not. Oh, another one. Let's see if I can get him. <laughs> I love that. Oh, wow. Whoops. Okay. Trying to be a little bit stealthy here. It's not easy for me. I would much rather smack people with a tire iron. <laughs> I take it back. This sniper is awesome. Hmm, that's right, Kazi. Y'all good? Y'all down and dead? Wonderful. Run your Salisbury steaks. Hmm. Oh, I see you, sweet, sweet, sweet sugar. Right in the ass. And he's dead. No, nah, I ain't scared, homie. Take that. Don't move. Hold still, you'll be right as rain in a second. Damn it! Don't hit my robot with a bat. Piece of shit. Sniper for the win, baby. Can I shoot these? Those are so bright. Give them away my position, man. I'm gonna use this hilariously gigantic pistol for my next <laughs> opposition. Oh my gosh. All right. Making great timing, Kazi. Look at that money. Run that money. And them foods. Give me that. Mac and cheese. Hell yeah. What the hell was that? Kazi? You growling, bruh? What that is? Run that. Get all the money. Am I freaking seeing things? Who the hell is. Oh, it's down there. Okay. What else can I take? I guess that's everything. I don't think I can drop down like quietly in this. Oh, yes, I can. <laughs> Damn! Whoa, dude. Turned him into ash. That's awesome. Okay, we should be closing in on uh, Nick here pretty soon. What you got? Run your Salisbury steaks. Delicious. That's a hood classic. Let me see. Fuse. Yeah, you always need fuses. Silver Shroud? Yeah, maybe later. I want to be a superhero. I know I'm missing a lot of stuff. I'm not collecting junk right now. I just want to save Nick. He actually helps you find your kid, which is cool. How you doing in there, Valentine? Feeling <laughs> hungry? Want a snack? Keep talking, meathead. <laughs> I shot Dino in the head. He's still alive. Damn it, Dino, die! Why is your name Dino? Ridiculous. You know what? No. I'm slicing and dicing all these boys. Why not let the robot deal with it? I agree, Kazi. I can tell you were being sarcastic, but you should deal with it. <laughs> Told you you should deal with it. That's some cool stuff down here. 
Looking for more stem packs. I've been using too many stem packs, bro. I normally just eat food, but in the heat of battle, sometimes, you know, gotta use a stem pack. No, I don't need a shower right now. I know where Nick is, by the way. I'm just looking for uh, resources. All of the resources. Another shower. No, I'm good. What's in here? Do I? Wonderful. More showers. Hmm. Depot. Okay. Damn it, y'all took all the good stuff. Bastards. Was that a silver pocket watch? Hell yeah. What's that idea? Yeah, run that. Run that too. Got some good stuff down here. Purify water, let's go. Uh, was that the only henchman that was down here? That is not good. Toolbox, what's in here? Damn it. Damn it. There we go. That's it. Stealth boy. I don't really use stealth boys like that. I would much rather run blindly at my opposition and kill them. That's just my style, I guess. Let me see. Is that the only way back up? What's in here? Nothing. All right, let's get Valentine. Overseer door password? Hell yeah, run that. Shut up, Nick. What up, bro? Damn, you scary as hell. Ah, my knight in shining armor. Question is, why does he come all this way and risk life and limb for an old private eye? My son, Sean is missing. He was kidnapped. But I don't know who took him or where they went. Missing kid, huh? Well, you came to the right man, not the right place. I've been cooped up in here for weeks. Turns out the runaway daughter I came here to find wasn't kidnapped. She's Skinny Malone's new flame. Oh. And she's got a mean streak. Anyway, you got troubles, and I'm glad to help. But now ain't the time. Let's blow this joint. Then we'll talk. Awesome. I'm taking this. Excellent. All offenders permanently have 100 more caps for bartering. Wonderful. Malone's crew here used to be small time, muscled out of the old neighborhood by bigger players. This is Vault Tech interview number 03 for the position of Overseer for Vault 114. Interview subject, Benjamin Beasley. Mr. Beasley, as Overseer of Vault 114, how would you settle a disagreement between two of your vault residents? Well, I would obviously take it through the proper channels, assuming neither of their requests were against the law, of course. This is, of course, assuming that the conflict had already gone through all the other members of the vault's residence council that I plan on organizing. Vault residence council, you say? Yes, of course. People need government. They yearn for it. I think it's a civic duty of every red-blooded American patriot to serve the... How do you want to play this? Yes, I think we have everything we need here. Thank Nick. you. Oh, yes, already? I'm sure you will. Please well, make sure to fill out... Damn it, there's too much dialogue going on. Hold on. Around every corner. I should not have done that. Um, Trigger man, prepare to die. <laughs> Yeah, no shit. Die! I'm leaving with a scary detective out of my way. You and your damn ponytail deserved death. Okay, here we go. Where you at, bruh? Come here! Oh, damn it. I missed. That's your fault somehow. Come closer to me. Come closer, I say. 
There you go, sweetness. Where you going, Nick? Nick is the way out of here, man. Cigarettes. I forgot that he was a synth. Did they like not finish him or something? He has holes in his throat. Hard and loud, huh? Well, gets the job done. Yeah. Whoever cleans up the floors. No, nobody's gonna clean this up. Let me see if I can get it open. Oh, sorry, Nick. Almost got. There we are. Hell of a lot easier to do when the lock isn't on the other side. Sorry. After you, please. Nick! Son of a bitch! You didn't see him? He just ran past the enemy. You taking care of the next one, bro. What what did I just say? You're on your own, Nick. Kazi, you can help me if you want to. Hmm. Oh, a comic. Game plus five action points. Thank you. Y'all good? Y'all taking too long. Hold on. <laughs> wow. Seriously, dude. <laughs> oh, man. What you got? There's too many of these dudes, bro. This is ridiculous. Upgrades. I already know what I want. Lock picking. Where is that? Expert. Let's go. Damn it. What's in here? Hmm. I'll take all of this for no reason. Damn it, Nick. Start fighting more. <laughs> Why, do, why does he run right past people? I don't understand that. Just leaving them all to me and Kazi. Oh, look at that. Bombs. Damn it. We are in a rush right now. Cannot afford this. Nice. Deathclaw hand. Sure. Anything else of use? Bowler hat. Always need an extra for Kazi. Comfy pillow. Yes, I'll take that. All right. We're making great timing, Kazi. Whiskey, hell yeah. Can sell that. And I think you can do like, uh, make different foods with whiskey too. So soon. Coffee cup, sugar Just bombs. Stop. Look at all this food, Nick. You ran right past this stuff. Is there something in the unrusted can? We'll find out. Hmm, I think that's all the food. Purify water, look at all these goods. Hmm. Coward. Knew you didn't have it in you. Shut up, Trick. I'm scavenging. More stairs? More stairs, Nick. You're a synth. Do you feel this? What the hell are you talking about, bro? You don't get tired. <laughs> Y'all take care of the rest. What's that? Okay, Kazi, you don't have to stick with me, bro. If you see enemies, you can go kill them if you like. What's that? Another depot. Hmm. In the middle of a firefight, I'm gonna pick this lock to see what's in here. Hopefully it's weapons I can use. Or ammo for my weapons that I can use. Oh, look at this. Tuxedo, hell yeah. Look at all that money. This must be Skinny Malone's stash. What's that? Oh, hell, look at all. Oh, yeah. Run it. Run all of that. Oh, yeah. Damn it, Master Lock. Dude, just run up on him and slice him. What y'all doing? Hmm. And remember to take all they ducats. Don't leave no ducats behind. Okay. Nothing there. I think that's it. 
Anything in here I can use? Yep. I'll take the cigarettes, the whiskey, more whiskey, whiskey bottles. I'm not taking that big ass gun. They're actually pretty weak. Just saying. Get him alone, and the rest of his boys are waiting for us somewhere. The name's uh, ironic, but don't let that fool you. He's dangerous. Another locked door. Okay. My house, shoot up my guys. You have any idea how much this is going to set me back? I wouldn't be here if it weren't for your two timing dame, Skinny. You ought to tell her to write home more often. Oh, poor little Valentine. Ashamed you got beat up by a girl. I'll just run back home to daddy, shall I? Should have left it alone, Nikki. This ain't the old neighborhood. In this vault, I'm king of the castle, you hear me? And I ain't letting some private dick shut us down now that I finally got a good thing going. I told you we should have just killed him! Wow. Then you had to get all sentimental. All that stupid crap about the old times. Dala, I'm handling this. Skinny Malone's always got things under control. Oh yeah? Then what's this guy doing here, huh? Valentine must have brought him here to rub us all out. Uh, can I save it? Yeah, I'm gonna save it and mess with some stuff. Lady, you should leave. I've killed all his men. He is no longer king. Darla, listen to me. You have a home to go back to. You don't want to throw your life away with these thugs. I... I... You're right! Really? What am I doing? I've gotten all mixed up. Darla! Where... Where are you going? Home, Skinny. Where I should have been all this time. This is goodbye for us. I did it? Oh, come on, Nikki. You cost me my men. Now you and your friend cost me my girl. My friend here just did you a favor, Skinny. You always did have bad taste in women. Now that she's not around to feed that temper of yours, maybe you'll see sense and let us walk. You still owe me for two weeks in the hole. You smug, overconfident ass. Get out of here. All right. You get to the count of ten. I still see your face after that. I'm gunning both of you down. Well, since you've threatened me. One. Two. He threatened me. I'm not leaving. Three. How do you want to die, Skinny? Four. Tire iron, shotgun. What do you want? Five. Uh, let's go tire iron. Six. <laughs> seven. Quick save for no reason. Eight. Uh-huh. Nine, ten. Let's do it. Let's go. <laughs> You'll die, Skinny. You'll die right here. You could have lived, friend. <laughs> ah, what you got, Skinny? Run your shit. Formal hat and a tuxedo. Get butt naked. Run your shit. Could have lived. You chose death. <laughs> oh, that's great. Ah, look at that. Silver locket. Oh man, sorry about that. I don't like being threatened. If I, bro, if I can handle real situations like that when I'm when I'm threatened, life would be so much better for me. Not necessarily kill people, but just, ugh. There's actual consequences for <laughs> your actions in real life. Uh, let's catch up to the detective, Kazi. Damn it, Nick, where did you run to? Swan's pawn. I'm not fighting him right now. It's a giant super mutant. I think Nick is still running. Follow Nick Valentine. Uh, I don't see Nick. I'm hoping he's not dead. And fall in, or fall into into some horrible glitch. If that's the case, buddy is just gone. I don't I don't know what to tell him. Hmm. What's in here? Oh hell yeah. Oh dude, there you are. Ah, look at that Commonwealth sky. Never thought anything 
so naturally ominous could end up looking so inviting. Thanks for getting me out. How did you know where to find me, anyway? Not many people knew where I went. Your secretary, Ellie. She sent me. She did? I should give her a raise. Now, you mentioned something about your son, Sean, and how he went missing. I want you to come to my office in Diamond City. Give me all the details. Besides, I think you've earned a chance to sit down and clear your head. I'll meet you there. See you in Diamond City. Peace, bro. Yeah, you know what? That's actually going to do it for us here at Battle Tested Beast Productions. My name is Ibaka. Thank you for dealing with my scratchy voice today. There goes Nick. Off to hug his own kind. I see a mannequin, mannequin in the distance. Anyway, <laughs> thank you so much. Uh, and good night.